This week, China's official Communist Party media have signaled it will reform the notorious labor camp system. It's bringing that system under scrutiny both for human rights abuses and for guzzling massive amounts of taxpayers' money. It's still unclear how exactly the Chinese re-education through labor system will be reformed, but the nationwide system of labor camps are increasingly under fire for the extensive brutality they are known for, as well as their waste of public funds. Since official comments by Chinese Communist Party media early this week, it appears the regime is planning to introduce changes to the system. Whether cosmetic alterations or significant changes are in store, one thing is clear. Getting rid of the system altogether would save Chinese taxpayers a huge amount of money. The Guangdong Province Re-Education Through Labor Bureau recently published its budget for 2012. It was 511 million yuan or around 82 million U.S. dollars. 90 percent of that was taxpayers' money. Online author Wu Jianguo said this is theft of the public's hard-earned money. That means the system is harmful to everyone, not just those detained in labor camps. If just one province like Guangdong needs more than 400 million renminbi, then how much is needed for all of China? It would be an astronomical figure. This money is from public finance, which means it's the money of taxpayers. Labor camps are widely considered unmonitored legal black holes. Serious widespread abuse against detainees are frequently reported. Some from suppressed groups are purposefully sent to the labor camp facilities for intensive torture sessions. Economist Chen Xiaonong says the Chinese public should demand to monitor any plans to reform the system. I absolutely do not believe that the party can abolish the system so easily. If anyone thinks the party will do it, they are a fool. It'll just change to another name. The party has pulled too many of these kinds of tricks all through its history. It's not the first time. According to official data, currently there are 350 labor camps in mainland China where 190,000 people are detained. However, some human rights observers have estimated that the total number of detainees in labor camps is actually about one million people.